Hi, my Leos. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I'm doing your weekly spread for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. Um, my nose, I'm a little bit nasally. Sorry, guys. Um, I have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes, so please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. Um, what else? I have um, on the website, jamiezebra23.com, I've got full-size candles, do-it-yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits, crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense sage. I have protection bracelets, pendulums for divination and prophecy, and lots more on the website, jamiezebra23.com. So Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers is your weekly spread. You got good news. You're headed towards new love. If that's what you wanted, um, it could possibly be with a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. Big emphasis on Scorpio. Also, um, could be with a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius. Um, but again, more water is showing up. So this is either a watery um, energy person or it's an actual water sign or an air sign. But it shows somebody's going with the flow. I feel like somebody might meet new love at work. If you travel for work or if like, work isn't like in your town or in your city, you have to travel a little bit further outward. Um, you're probably going to find new love at this job because it looks like it's at a distance. Um, I also feel like some of you might be um, trying new things. You might start like using new apps or start using new like social media things like um, you know dating sites, anything that has to do with like uh, like social media stuff like where you can talk to people that are not local, that sort of thing. Um, I feel like people are going to get new cell phones that can do um, different things, like maybe FaceTime, different, different, um, different like functions that that will be easy for you to meet people. Oh, be careful, please. Please don't spill anything else. Okay. I also feel like somebody might be telling one person one thing, but then doing another. So maybe some of you are calling someone, telling them that you want a new beginning with them, but then you're out cheating and lying or drinking or drugging or doing crazy things. I feel like somebody's not being honest. So it's kind of like um, if somebody's like an alcoholic, they tell their partner, oh, I haven't had a drink for six months. I'm like, that's funny. Because when I drove by the bar yesterday, I saw you there. So somebody's trying to like sell a story that's not true. Oh, I've been, I've been clean all this time. I haven't been out even one time. All I've been doing is just sitting home and eating potato chips. Nope, didn't happen. Nope, you've been out every night. I saw you. I drove past you and I saw you. I saw you. Um, and then also, uh, somebody might get caught with another man or a woman. Um, I feel like somebody's already broken up. So it's kind of like, you know, two people are broken up, but maybe one person has hope of getting back together, so they're not exactly telling the other party. You know, we did break up and I'm dating now. They might be telling them, I haven't even started dating yet. I haven't started, but they have. They're, they've had sex with lots of different people and they're dating. They're doing it. They're living their life. They're going to lie about it, of course, because they're... See... And I don't want to call this cheating because I don't think it is. So it's kind of like it's like if, if I, let's say, for example, if I was to tell somebody, hey, listen, I don't want to be with you anymore. Go live your life. I don't care what you do. You're like, okay, I'm going to go live my life. Are you sure that's what you want? I'm going to go live. Are you sure? Yep, I'm sure. Stay away. Don't come here. Don't talk to me. And then they go start sleeping with other people. Could I really be mad? I told them to. <laughs> so it's kind of like that. But I feel like the other party might be selfish and might take it like, okay, you cheated on me. <laughs> even though he kept telling the person I don't want to be with you so it's like that kind of so I don't really feel like anybody's really doing anything wrong because somebody already stated that they didn't want to be with the person so okay now let's talk about finances for the week okay so financially for the week it looks like you guys have new contracts new partnerships coming up um, I also feel like you guys are merging things together this week um, some of you will be uh, working as far like your job might be in transportation some of you do uber some of you do lyft but it's gonna be a, a very good week for you also i feel like oh no 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 let him have his monkey give, give the monkey back please um i also feel like for a lot of you you have business ideas and business plans and they're gonna go very very smooth this week just a lot of cash so for those of you that work on tips or maybe for some reason you're getting a lot of cash this week not just like a paycheck but cash it's going to be a good week for that. I also feel like some of you might find out that this this week that somebody puts you on child support. 
and that might make you mad this week. Somebody expects for you to start paying your way, paying for your children. All right, guys, that was your weekly spread, jamiezebra23.com. Ta-ta for now.